this space, this you mean initially the whole learning space, is basically used for students' collaboration, discussions, and it gives a good a good opportunity actually for students to come out from their usual traditional classroom and having a space of where it is not uh, limited to anybody to use and it's, it's, it is actually giving them a choice of their own freedom as well to express themselves how to learn for themselves. We have been using this um, 21st century learning space for almost two months already and we have been exposing the students a lot of um, different learning modalities uh, where teacher is um, being the facilitator, where the students have, have uh, undergone um, different uh, group activities and then uh, the, there is a lot of um, collaborations within the students, there's a lot of questioning from the students and we allow the students to use uh, the whole open space um, in order to create their work and this will eventually show the creativeness uh, of the students. I like in the learning space because it is a very comfortable place and a cozy place for learning and it's a perfect place to improve our learning. Saya merasa selesa mengajar di learning space ini di mana pelajar-pelajar yang lemah dapat dibawa keluar uh, diberi uh, pelajaran uh, secara wantuan. Why do you like this learning space? Because uh, we are collaborating with two teachers in one in one class, uh, and it's easier because it's spacious and uh, because um, it's easy for us to do theory in the learning space. What is your subject now? PE. Okay, what are you doing? <coughs> Presentation. I use the technology in most of my lessons. So do my students, especially the SIM students. But for non-SIMs, they have to share. That is working in groups. I use different relevant apps in my teaching. My students are free to choose and use any apps they like depending on the activities or tasks assigned. Uh, what do you feel sejak pakai iPad berbeza dengan sebelum ini? Makin senang. Makin senang lah. And how about you? Muda? Fun. The new flexible learning space has changed the way of teaching dramatically. It has made it possible for us to sort of, you know, introduce new varieties of teaching, pedagogies, one-to-one, uh, -one, small group, whole class, a lot of different kinds of uh, and ways of teaching is able to be implemented in this new flexible learning space. We believe that um, by using this type of learning, uh, we are able to create incredibly uh, deep and broad learning experiences for the students and giving them the tool 
uh, the tools to find that factual information by themselves. So by giving them the right tools and we as a teacher being the facilitator, so the students will be able to assess the knowledge, to create, to analyze, to compare and contrast, to synthesize and to design new things based on their own creativity.